A sorry at last from England's wealthy water companies over the sewage spills that have blighted our beaches and rivers. Critics say the problem's been brewing for decades as privatised suppliers paid out profits to shareholders instead of investing in infrastructure. Now comes a long-awaited apology. I'm here today on behalf of the water industry to say sorry. I think uh, we've listened, uh, we've heard, we've, uh, we understand the upset that has been caused and the anger that people feel. Well, the companies are pledging billions to upgrade sewers, but not from their own pockets. It seems hard-pressed customers will be forced to foot the bill. Also tonight. Recollections may vary. The right royal mystery of what did or didn't happen in that New York City car chase. Here mounting troubles for the Royal Mail as it posts a billion pound loss. A 21st century conflict fought with World War II weapons. Ukraine's increasingly urgent need for modern military support and... Give them back to me or I'll... There's no place like jail. The FBI charges a man with stealing Dorothy's famous ruby slippers. This is the ITV Evening News with Mary Nightingale. Good evening. England's multi-million pound water companies apologised today for repeatedly dumping raw sewage in rivers and along the coast. The spills have blighted beauty spots and left the UK with some of Europe's dirtiest beaches. After growing outrage, the water companies have now promised to clean up their act. They will invest, they say, billions of pounds in upgrading sewers. But customers are likely to have to pay for it, while their shareholders still enjoy bumper payouts. And campaigners say that stinks, as Amy Lewis now reports.